and welcome to Take 5 with the Regional Chamber. I'm Kim Calvert. A Northeast Ohio landscaping company with a national reputation recently expanded its footprint in the valley and hopes to continue its growth here. Envirescapes purchased American Beauty Landscaping and now has five locations, including in Boardman and Austin Town. Leslie Davis caught up with the owner, Todd Pugh, to talk about the company's growth. Todd Pugh got his start in lawn care and landscaping at the young age of 14. He didn't know it at the time, but that one early grass cutting client would end up turning into a major landscaping operation. So we started out as Todd's Lawn Care at 14, then it went to Todd's Landscaping because we, we really graduated and were able to landscape instead of just mow. And then it went to Todd's Enviroscapes in about 92, and then in about uh, 2000, we switched it over just to straight Enviroscapes to have a little more of a corporate feel. Enviroscapes is a complete outdoor landscaping company. They design, install, and maintain landscaping. The company now has five locations in Northeast Ohio, including two in the Valley. The company has 220 employees. About 75 of them work at the Austintown and Boardman locations. Although they've grown considerably, Todd makes it his mission to remain accessible to both his employees and his clients. Well, the one thing that our real advantage of our company is, is we're a large company, which means we have a great capacity to serve large customers, yet we're still, you know, I'm privately owned, you know, we, I own the business, my cell phone is on our website, so you can get to the owner anytime, you can get to our management, there's not a lot of bureaucracy, so we've been able to, you know, grow the business to service our clients who have needs, yet at the same time be very accessible. Todd says there's a number of things that have contributed to his success so far. He says he's had great clients who run their own businesses and he's learned from them. He also says he loves to see his employees rise through the ranks and he knows he has to keep them busy in order to retain them. And finally, he says he's always open to making changes when necessary. Our business at one point was 90% residential. Today it's 10% residential. It was 90% design build at one point. Today it's about 25% design build. So we've been able to uh, stay very nimble. Um, the markets changed, so we've changed with the markets. Todd's vision for Enviroscapes is to become the number one landscape company in the world. And although that doesn't necessarily mean the biggest, it does mean he wants to continue the growth they've been experiencing, both organic growth and through acquisitions. For Take 5 with the Regional Chamber, I'm Leslie Davis. You can find out more about Enviroscapes at growinggood.com. While many of us are enjoying our summer, the Trumbull Community Action Program is preparing for the start of school. TCAP's Head Start program is beginning early this year on August 23rd. They're opening a 7th Center in Cortland, bringing their maximum enrollment up to 603 students. TCAP's Head Start director says the preschool program not only prepares 3 to 5 year olds for kindergarten, it also addresses the needs of the whole family. We have family advocates that help the parents. We have um, a health manager, we make sure that the children have a medical home, that they have a doctor, a dentist, and we have um, events here so the children can get physicals and dentals, and we make sure that they have all their immunizations so everything's up to date for them. TCAP is holding an enrollment event on August 2nd from 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. at their Niles location. There will be administrators on hand to help with the enrollment process as well as activities for kids. To find out more, visit tcaphelps.org. We hope you enjoyed this edition of Take 5, and we'll see you again next week. With the Regional Chamber, I'm Kim Calvert. Take 5 with the Regional Chamber is produced by Mahoning Valley Productions, where we tell your stories.